Hi to all of my four fans. I'm back here uh, for my vlog and this time I'm in Malta to visit my dear friend Demi. Hi. From Aberdeen to Malta, here we are. It's kind of the same. This is the largest natural harbour in the Mediterranean. Good morning. Yesterday we went out, today we woke up really early and we're now in Medina, which is this fortified town, fortified town in Malta, where there is this massive basilica where the bishop lives. Where are we going? Gozo. What's Gozo? How many dogs do you have? Jesse! Amy also has cats. This is Mopsy. Tigger. Jack. Jez. Peanut. Tom. Phoebe. Fluffy. He thinks he lives here, but he doesn't. We are in Schlendi, this tiny village in the southern side of Gozo. And this is their beach. We entered the cave in Schlendi, this incredibly mysterious place that no one knows. Amy is leading the exploration. Woo! <laughs> and here we are. Yeah, it's not gonna show up. We are stargazing on the sea. Can you hear the sea at least? Because clearly you can't see the stars. We are in the citadel of Gozo, which was the stronghold of the island. And this is the cathedral. These are the typical Maltese walls, crafted by hand, stone by stone, uh, to divide fields and they are home to a lot of species like snakes and snails and all of them luckily i can't see any snakes these temples are called gigantia because people used to think they were built by giants to be fair they are taller than me which makes them absolute giants this beach down here is Ramla and it's famous for its red sand and now we're standing on Calypso's cave where Ulysses spent seven years because Gozo is identified with Ojija Malta is what happens when Britain and Italy have a child Hi Amy, where are we? We're in the inland sea. Having a tira. This is the inland sea. And these are some boat houses. And this is where the azure window used to be. Today I bought souvenirs for my family. They are Shwaini salt. But where does it come from? They're salt pans. I mean, I think that's in the name. They collect water during the winter and then in summer they dry out, leaving salt. Fun fact, the Romans started them in Kirikoso. So today we're going snorkeling. 